Hey guys, so it's just going to be me for the intro. So for this video, I am going to be telling you guys how our relationship is through my point of view, what type of problems do I think that we have, and then Alex is gonna get the turn to do the same thing to tell you guys how he feels about the relationship. Because usually when we try to talk to each other about it, we end up arguing and it's not working, it's not leading anywhere. Um, and I feel like this might be the best thing to do because at one point we are able to just take the time to view this video and listen and actually try to understand each other. And we also want to share this part of our lives with you guys because we want you guys to know what our relationship is truly like so you guys don't have to assume anything. Alright, so I guess it's my turn. So basically... In, well, in my opinion, there's not many problems with our relationship, but... I want to say I want to start with the trust part of our relationship. I honestly been having some issues with Alex regarding his phone. I feel like there should be more trust in our relationship than there is. Recently, he added a female on Facebook and this girl him and this girl used to have like this thing back in the day i knew him back then obviously and they call it a quit and then all of a sudden they've never talked at least not to my knowledge and then all of a sudden like i see on facebook that alex became friends with this girl i feel like i feel like Haley's insecure when she like she shouldn't be nowhere near insecure at all and now i found out on my own through facebook because currently he's not letting me go through his phone and another thing that we've been having a problem with is Haley keeps saying that i'm adding females when i shouldn't be but you know truly the reason i add females is because i know that our relationship is is way too strong to to let that bother us and the reason I add people is you know they, they add me I don't go and look and to add them they add me so I'm like okay I accept you guys know I accept all you guys on Facebook regardless who you are because you know you if you want to add me as a friend okay you can add me it doesn't do nothing literally all you can do is see my profile and see my relationship with Haley so I don't know, I feel like Haley needs to realize that and to realize that our relationship is strong enough to, you know, to not let these females get in, get in the way because, you know, I'm not messaging them females, I'm not doing nothing. The only people that I reply to you is you guys. And it's, it's all about, you know, our videos and our content, so. He says that I need to learn how to trust him without actually, like, having any evidence, if you know what I mean. So I'm really upset about the part that he thinks it's okay to add females. Like I know, well not necessarily females, but like females that you had a history with. Do you know what I'm saying? Like I know I didn't tell him that he couldn't be friends with her, he couldn't add her, he couldn't talk to her. But I feel like knowing that they had a history before, that he would... Oh, respect me I want to say like I feel like he would respect me not to add this girl not to give her the time of day and I know that he says that he didn't message her and I mean I didn't or I haven't seen any messages um, but still though it's like it's a little concerning to know that I'm pretty sure he wouldn't want me doing that you know like he wouldn't want me adding guys that I probably had a history with back in the day and then just telling him well you know you have to trust me so that's an issue for me and you know I I would definitely like to respect you more like I didn't know you didn't want me to add people like I could literally just stop adding people right now and hopefully that will make you trust me more because that's something very little that shouldn't be a, you know, a problem for our relationship because we should have that trust. Recently, you guys have been commenting and it's a, it's a, a lot of you 
have been commenting that Alex for some reason seems to be annoyed with me like he he seems to be distant and I know that since it's my relationship and I'm in the relationship sometimes I can't see things and you guys are like an outside view like a fresh eye and then when I read these comments and I'm going and I'm looking through the video it's like it leaves me thinking y'all like sometimes I feel like he really is distant or like he no longer finds me funny he finds me more of annoying now and I don't like that I don't like that because I feel like he he should love my personality the way that it is and if it annoys him like is, it, is this really meant to be first things first let me address the cheating comments because that seems to be inside Haley's head somehow so yeah I guess you guys have been um, saying that I've been acting different which I don't know I don't see it but Haley's Haley is getting into Haley's head and she's like oh even they're saying you're acting different but um I don't know I, I, I guess you guys are so I don't know if you guys are like trolling like just messing with Haley on purpose or y'all really do think that because um, I'm definitely not cheating. It's nothing like that. I don't know where y'all getting this information from. I think it's like it's like a high school rumor. Like somebody puts it in the comment section. And then everybody sees it. And then they're like, oh, look at this. And then they comment. And it goes around like a rumor. It's our, our relationship. He should be respecting what I, how I feel. How I think he should, you know, like handle things. And you guys called him out. You guys kept saying, commenting, like, girl, open your eyes. He's cheating on you. Like, I don't I don't know. I really do not know at this point, like, what to do, what to believe. Because it's like there's things that he's doing that I don't like. But it's not like I'm finding messages of him cheating or, you know what I'm saying? It's hard, y'all. It's difficult. So I think it's definitely just a rumor, guys. Like, I know you guys are reading comments, and then y'all, it gets into y'all's head, and now y'all think I'm cheating. Like, what the heck? And another thing, and I don't really want to give this too much time, because honestly, it's not a big of a deal. But a lot of you guys are saying that I'm acting some type of way with his brother, Jordan. Like, if I'm trying to flirt with him, or I don't, I don't know but i just want you guys to know that jordan is like a brother to me and i love him and he he is not here very often he goes out to work and when he comes back you know like i i want to hang out with him i want to have fun with him including alex but that shouldn't that shouldn't be suspicion for you guys to think that there's something else going on with him and i like it's literally just brotherly sisterly sisterly love like we're that close that can happen like oh you guys are saying like oh she, she likes my brother this and that like they have a connection but you know it, it's obviously troll like i definitely don't take that serious i'm sure Haley don't take it serious it's a, another high school rumor so you know let's just leave it at that if you guys want to comment that you can comment that all you want but you know we know the truth and the truth is, there's there's just nothing there. They're, they're friends. And I don't know, they just have like a good relationship, I guess. But it seems like a normal relationship to me. So, I don't know. You guys make um, things into nothing, so. Well, let me ask y'all something. The girls. How long did it take your spouse to pop out the question? Because I know that for my sister, she literally got married within the year. My mom the same. My brother, I think it took him like two, two and a half years. But, you know, they popped the question, y'all. I'm still sitting here to this day. And it's been seven years going into eight. And I mean, I love him. I love what we have. I, I know that 
I don't want to be the person to rush things or to make him do something that he does not want to do. But I at least want to feel like, like this is something that he wants. You know what I'm saying? Like I know that sometimes we do talk about it, but I feel like we don't talk about it like serious enough. And I, I am hoping that one day he does pop the question, but I'm just wondering how many more years is it going to take him to be comfortable? I don't know. I feel like if it was me, I would have already popped the question to him. I don't know. Obviously, we're not perfect, but you know, we love each other. And I love Haley a lot, and she should know that. And I know she always says, well, you know, why aren't we married? You haven't popped the question. You haven't, you know, told me. It's been seven years. But, you know, most of those years, we were young teenagers. Obviously, we're not going to get married that young. So, you know, we had been together for seven years, but most of it was our teenage years. So there was no need to get married in our teenage years. And now that we're getting older, um... Pretty much, I just want to save enough money so that Haley can have, you know, a proper wedding that she can remember, that she can look back on, you know, that we were able to film for you guys and for her to see and look back on, not just, you know, a quick wedding just because she's insecure about our relationship. So I feel like, um, yeah, I definitely, uh, definitely want to marry Haley, so she shouldn't feel insecure about that either. So hopefully Haley can trust me a lot more and you know, I can feel, I, I definitely feel why she has like these trust issues, but I want her to know that it's, it's absolutely nothing and our relationship is way too strong to be, you know, interrupted by rumors and allegations. So hopefully we can continue our relationship as it's been going without insecurities because Haley, I love you and I don't want you to feel insecure about our relationship because there's no reason to.